a uh, little good news uh, that I received today. Um, well, we got in yesterday, but I received it today. Uh, is that we were accepted into the caregivers program. Uh, my caregiver and I were accepted into the caregivers program again. Uh, well, again for me, um, not not my caregiver. Um, so th this is the what the situation is. Uh, I'm today's video. I'm gonna break down what uh, this monthly stipend turns out to within a year, three years, and five years. Um, in New York City, a tier three high dependence. You're seeing thirty one fifty one at fourteen cents. Um, before I continue, do me a favor, subscribe. Um, Hopefully by subscribing, uh, you guys get to see more videos, um, hit the alert button. Um, so like that, you'll be able to not get notified when another video pops up uh, that I will have uploaded. Um, and at the same time, it will motivate you to share the videos with other veterans um, and help them, you know, through these videos um, on how it helped you, um, what obstacles you came across, um, how... You know, maybe you want to share within the comments of how you got over these obstacles and were able to get service connected and stuff like that. Um, so, you know, it, it, at the end of the day, what I'm looking for is to create a little community to not only help each other out, but at the same time, um, show how we overcame obstacles when we became service connected and other benefits that are allotted to us, you know. Um, so, yes, please do me a favor, subscribe. All right. So um, let's continue. Um so the 3154, um, this is what a New York City caregiver is seeing uh, within tier three, three, tier two, tier one. Uh, 3154 for tier three, 1969 for tier two, and 787 for a tier one within a month. Uh, those are the monthly stipends that you'll be seeing for each tier. Within the year for tier three, you'll be seeing close to 38 grand. Uh, for tier two, you'll be seeing close to 24 grand. Um, in tier one, you'll be seeing over nine grand. Um, within three years, tier three would be a hundred, close to a little over uh, one hundred thirteen grand. Um, tier two would be close to seventy one thousand, and tier one would be a little over twenty eight grand. Within five years, you'll be uh, tier three would be one hundred eighty nine thousand. Uh, tier two would be one hundred eighteen thousand, and tier one would be over forty seven thousand. Now, what does this do? What does this extra cash does? It's not a you know, again. This is not going to be forever. You know, again, what I let me re uh, reiterate what was reiterated to me. This is a rehab program. You know, so forever. How long? You know, obviously, I'm not going to put ten years, twenty years, none of that, because this program might not be out forever. You know, um, and it is just a benefit. You know, so. Uh, you know, things such as this money that could be used for, you know, um, I do have carpal tunnel, you know, I do have back problems. So, um, because of my carpal tunnel, you know, I can't be carrying things, you know, so, um, if my caregiver can't give me a haircut, I could go, you know, and pay to get a haircut, uh, through the money that has been allotted to us, you know, due to tier three, you know, or I can pay to, for my, uh, groceries to be delivered if my caregiver is not around. Or uh, my caregiver and I can go to the ER, you know, and uh, take a cab whenever, uh, you know, my back goes out or something like that, you know. Or let's say I'm with my caregiver and we shop too much, you know, in regards to groceries because we're shopping for the month, you know, then um, we can pay for the for the delivery options. You know, there's little things here and there that, that, that you know, this uh, money would be able to help out with you know at the end of the day it's just extra cash you know and it, it the benefits is great you know um at the same time you know if um if we need anything extra installed within your um you know in our home you know uh such as uh bar handles in the bathroom or anything like that um then it will be taken care of uh through the caregivers program all we need to do is just let the ner uh, caregiver nurse uh, know or the coordinator know, and it will be taken care of. Um, so, you know, these are the benefits that come with the being uh, uh, a caregiver. Now, what I wanted to reiterate in regards to a mistake that I did uh, in the last video in regards to the caregivers. Um, they're, based on the counties, it is different um, on what a caregiver would be getting paid. Um, I was corrected, uh, yeah, uh, I believe when I uploaded the video either yesterday or the day before I was corrected in regards to it. Um, and it's cool because at the end of the day, uh, 
based on the calculations, you know, I was able to confirm um, the, the pay and it does differentiate um, in regards to counties. So, you know, um, it, again, it's at the end of the day, it's based on local hourly wage. Uh, a wage um, and in New York, uh, the hourly wage is uh, 1811. Um, so upstate New York City, you know, um, Suffolk County, it's so far 1811, but, you know, in states like Ohio or Florida, uh, it changes, you know, based on counties. Um, so not all of it is the same, you know, it differentiates. Um, so, you know, again, um, the cash could be extra. You do, you do what seems, uh, necessary for, uh, taking care of your veteran, you know, um, for you caregivers, uh, for you veterans, you know, you decide how you want to go about with this extra cash. Uh, so, you know, um, if you wish how to get into the caregivers program, um, just do me a favor. I'll be putting up this information up again, but you know, uh, subscribe to the YouTube channel, um, and follow along, you know, and hopefully you guys will be getting, uh, approved, uh, to get into the caregivers program. I do put up the activity activities of daily living sheet, um, and what it is that you, uh, know exactly of what you would need to say, um, or what you go through and what they want to hear, um, when going, you know, trying to get into the, well, when trying to, um, figure out when they're trying to figure out the tiers um and what you rate um but i again i'll be putting all this information up so subscribe you know share the channel with a lot of um any other veterans that you know um and uh hopefully it helps you guys out i know i have two other guys right now that um, i'm helping and uh hopefully they get into the program as well all right take care guys um and do me a favor have a great day and hopefully your weekend went as great as mine all right bye-bye